In this video, we're going to go over the Auto Detect button in the Features tab. This button allows you to create geometry on the fly when you're away from the keyboard measuring point groups. So to get started, if you click the drop down of the Auto Detect button, your settings will pop up. Here you can change the auto fit tolerance and you can also decide whether or not projection planes will be automatically set as you measure. So I'm going to click this button and it'll pop up in my inspection bar and tree and I can start to measure my first feature. So right here, it resolved that point group into a plane. And up in the features tab, you can see it also automatically set that plane as my projection plane. So the next few bolt holes that I measure are going to be projected up. The same thing will happen if I measure a plane that's orthogonal to this plane. It'll project this plane up as a line. So right there I just measured a plane that is angled to the current position projection plane and I'll resolve it and it'll set that as my new projection plane. So when I'm ready I can measure a bolt hole and I'll project it correctly. So if I don't want any projection planes to measure some 3D objects on this part, I can go up to my features tab and I can select do not project to plane. So now I can go and measure spheres and cones. So if I unhide my CAD, you can see that this shape right here was supposed to resolve into a cone and it went instead to a cylinder. So in my tree, if I go to that relationship and I right click, I can hit reset relationship geometry and I can choose cone from that list. And it'll make that for me. Once you're all done measuring your relationships and you have your part, you can go up to build, detect CAD nominals by proximity, select all the relationships, and it'll add those nominals into your tree for you under those relationships. 